New at five, driverless cars in the D about to become a reality. Waymo is bringing its fully autonomous ride hailing service to Detroit. Pretty futuristic. The company has already been testing cars in Michigan winters, including in the UP. This week, it will start getting its cars familiarized with Detroit's historic streets, but they're not quite ready for passengers just yet. 7 News Detroit reporter Evan Seary is seeing what Detroiters think about self-driving cars in the auto capital of the world. Evan. Excited uh, to launch, um, you know, our service in Detroit, especially with the, the history in Detroit. It's time to add another chapter in Detroit's rich automobile history, a chapter perhaps even Henry Ford would think of as total fiction. Better performance than humans uh, is really what we're after. Beginning this week, Jake Treader, who is a technical program manager for Waymo, says Detroiters will see driverless cars cruising around Detroit. Yeah, we're really laying the foundation to offer a service, hopefully next year, to our uh, to the public. And so what we do first is we, we map the city, we map all the roads. Waymo, the autonomous driving tech company, launched in 2009 before dipping into Metro Detroit, building an engineering facility in Novi in 2016. We've been driving in and around the city for a number of years as we've tested out our technology. But now the public can get an even closer look and feel. Monday, Waymo announcing Detroit is one of three new U.S. cities that will see a robo-taxi service possibly as soon as next year. And so over time, we will expand the number of vehicles in the fleet to, you know, hundreds of vehicles, um, but we start very small. And here in Corktown, some are on board with those self-driving vehicles hitting these Detroit streets while others are not. To have a self-driving car? No. No, absolutely not. Detroiter Karima Regular says she was in an intense crash two years ago in a traditional vehicle. The accident I was in was very severe. So just imagine if it was nobody behind that wheel. What comes to mind when you see this? The future. I showed Jeremy Donahue Horrington a video of Waymo cars in action. You want to get in the car, you want to have a conference call while you're being driven somewhere? It's pretty cool. During this initial phase where Waymo cars get familiar with Detroit roads, Treader says they'll be supervised. A human will be in the driver's seat observing and making sure things run smoothly. And while weather conditions are clear now, I asked Treader what it will look like when snow and ice hit the city. You know, all of our sensors are kind of like mini car windshields, right? We've got heaters, we've got wipers, we've got uh, cleaning fluid that sprays on them. So we're cleaning the snow and ice off the sensors. We're cleaning all the salt and road grime off the sensors. Reporting from Corktown, Evan Siri, 7 News Detroit. Now look, I think it's cool, <laughs> but I'm going to wait a little while. I'm going to let y'all do it first and then tell me how it goes. They need to remember to get over for the queue line. Right? Yeah. You know. Well, that'll be programmed in, right? That'll be part of it. Perhaps. All right. We'll see how that goes. All right, goes. let's talk about this.